Hello, little friends. You often see me in books or on the water bottles you drink from, right? That's right, it's me. Ever wondered how I came to be? Let's start the story right now. Back in the early 20th century, scientist Wilhelm Harman had a creative idea to create an ink with essential oils that would release a fragrance when the paper was scratched. Wow, what a clever idea. This concept made newspapers more appealing to readers. But wait, my creation story hasn't come up yet. Fast forward a hundred years to the 1970s, Gail Matson was tasked with finding new ways to use 3M's adhesive technology. While brainstorming, he came up with the idea of creating stickers that could emit a scent when scratched. However, it wasn't until the 1960s that scratch and sniff stickers truly took off. The American inventor credited with this modern invention is Gail Matson, an American chemical engineer working for 3M a leading manufacturer of adhesives and other products. When Gale referenced Wilhelm Harman's product, he decided to build upon it, but make it much more affordable and simplify the process. The first product was born. According to my grandmother, The Little Rabbit Follows the Nose, published in 1971, was the first work that marked the birth of this sticker. My father has been transformed into the scent of peaches, the fruit that the adventurous rabbit searches for with his nose. My mother is the label of a rose. My uncle and aunt smell like pine cones and berries, respectively. It was funny. The kids must be very happy here. Around the 1980s, we were proud to be a trend for a whole decade. Millions of products were published during this time, and every child then held my family's products in their hands. The production process, huh? I'll tell you how my friends and I came to life. My friends and I are created through a micro-encapsulation process. Tiny capsules containing fragrance are specially designed to be printed on labels. Similar to creating a perfume, anything from the scent of candy to orange or even the fragrance of flowers can be crafted into these super tiny capsules. Can you imagine? The pleasant fragrance is surrounded by super tiny capsules that easily break when rubbed or scratched. The rubbing action breaks the tiny bubbles, releasing a very special scent. Due to micro-encapsulation, the fragrance can be preserved for a very long time, extending for several months or even many years. You can rub the sticker multiple times until all the extremely tiny capsules are worn out. The sticker will continue to emit fragrance until the capsules are depleted. Here's a fun fact. These stickers can be used for healing too. Some scientists believe that the scents released by stickers can be used to treat certain olfactory disorders. Today, as the world advances, you can create me or my friends with just a few small tools. Pretty interesting, right? Search for Scratch and Sniff DIY to make your own small sticker right now. Now I'm off to fulfill my mission, hidden deep within the pages of the books you hold up. Ha ha ha, goodbye. If you like our video, Please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Thank you. Goodbye.